It's more hell divers, as you can see. Um, how's everyone doing? Uh, I felt better. I got some allergies going. That's cool. What are you, what are you taking for it? Uh, halls and tea. <laughs> oh, you don't use. You're not using like Benadryl, right? No, no. I, I, you know, when when you get really bad allergies, you take a lot of Benadryl. You can also meet the Hat Man. Yeah. So who <laughs> who's the Hat? Before. Who's the Hat Man? Oh, it's a guy <laughs> that people apparently see when. They start hallucinating from taking too much Benadryl. Or, or he's a real guy. He's like, he's a sponsor for like, who makes Benadryl. He's like, you get a price, he gives you like a token. You take it five Benadryl at a time. Wow. I'm um, the hat man. Just shows up. Uh, according to drugs.com, <laughs> the, hat, <laughs> the hat man is a physical, fi fi fictional figure that started appearing on certain internet sites in the early 2000s that has recently been referred to as the Benadryl, <laughs> Benadryl hat man. <laughs> End quotes. After reports of people hallucinating inside of him after overconsumption or abuse of Benadryl, most of these reports have appeared on Reddit and 4chan. The Hat Man has also been associated with abuse of any other, you know, substances. So there you go. Hat Man. Now, is he a vigilante? Anyway, listen, if anyone wants to invite me to their game, now's a good time. <laughs> uh, I think we can all join on you. You just join then. Well, to answer your question, Vinny, I'm uh, I'm doing I'm doing fine. Okay, you haven't seen the Hat Man. I have not Black seen the Hat Man. Has joined squadron. Because in my mind, the Hat Man looks like that dude. You know the dude that's like, have you seen this guy in your dreams? And he's got like very thick eyebrows. Yeah, that guy. That's the Hat Man to me. It and like really creepy, like non-existent Black facial features. Yeah, squadron. I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe um. Maybe the Hat Man's the guy from Virtual Insanity. Jamiroquai. Yeah. Could be him. Could be. The hat he man. does wear a hat. Sometimes. I like He like slides this. over to you and steals your allergies. <laughs> I, I think that would be nice for you, Slides. Oh, yeah, it would be nice for you, though, John, because you might. I, I wouldn't mind. Just takes your hay fever away. Yeah. <laughs> Look at I'll be here to he take suffers your from our sins. Tips your hat, tips the hat away, just dissolves into the middle distance. Great. Have we all been able to unlock anything for the ship module yet? No. Yeah, I have a couple. Uh, yes. I, I need you. ten more, and then I can unlock a donation access license or exploding shrapnel or something. I have five ship modules. Yeah. So if we, we do well today. So anyway, everybody who's watching now, thank you for joining. Um, if you saw my previous Helldivers, you know that I actually enjoyed it. And I had a good time with it. And uh, I had some free time tonight. And I said, very last minute, hey, do you fellas want to play some game? And here we are. So yeah, should be fun. I am probably, but you know, if you're watching this, I'm in Boston right now, and I'm probably suffering from Hatman syndrome because I had to take Benadryl to take care of whatever funk I got at the con. But no, I mean, Boston's fun. This game is fun. Let's do it. Goodness gracious, let's game. All right, what are we fighting for? Oh, oh, oh! I have to do this. A prepare and launch ICBM. Yeah, we could do that. Okay. I'll do some acquisitions later. Because there's a new pass, right? Battle pass? Yeah. Yes, there is. Yeah. So I heard that they're fucking with people in this game by showing there's like flying bugs. Yeah. But only some people see them, and then the devs are like, we don't know what you're talking about. The only good bug is a dead bug, that kind of thing. I, I like it when a dev gaslights their fan base, <laughs> honestly. Yeah. Alright. Do I need to uh, bring ammo? I guess I can. Whatever you want, man.
I'm gonna be the turret man. I'm gonna bring a couple turrets because they're at least that's something I don't have to think about too much. Turret man, he's got a mortar in his head. Turret man. I'm trying to learn how to play that. I want to cover that Stone Temple pilot, that very real and cool Stone Temple pilot song. So you one the, day you got the tabs loaded up. Yeah, I got. I found the tabs. tabs. Yeah. It, was, uh, it was on the the uh, dark web. <laughs> the dark web tab. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah. Mysterious song only found on like the dark those, web. those tab websites that play the the song back in horrible MIDI. <laughs> that was that was my. Um, I remember when I was looking for Final Fantasy VII music when I first got my computer many years ago. I would download MIDI's and be like, why does this sound different? I didn't understand it. it. Took me a while to know what a MIDI was. I think in the early age of, of like getting music through through means, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I remember one time, not a MIDI, but I got I got I downloaded a Queens of the Stone Age song. And it was no one knows. Hmm. And, but the version I got didn't have the guitar solo. It had the backing orchestral forward in the track. Huh. And I can't find that version of the song anywhere. That's lost media now. So, or I, I, the hat man made me hallucinate. That was a hat know. man incident. Guaranteed. <laughs> he, he made the MIDI and he played it for you. But then... In Guitar Hero 3, the Queens of Stone Age song 3s and 7s is a different version than the album version of 3s and 7s. I didn't know that. Has a completely different lyric in the breakdown. Weird. I, I gotta weird. I gotta find that and, and see what that's about, because that's very interesting to me. I I just think finding just tracks that were like we do call we don't call them a B side, just like unfinished or not final tracks just randomly is so weird yeah i mean if you're a beatles fan that's there's a million different you know sure. like helter skelter has a very slow version that's like unfinished and it's it's actually really cool it's it's some people prefer it but it's fun yeah i mean that was me with nirvana i mean you've probably heard my stories of, of the bootlegs in wildwood i'd buy <laughs> cds and it would have a different song name and i'd be like oh a new song and it was just the same song, but, you know, what they did was they sped it up slightly, or they recorded it through a boombox and called it a demo. <laughs> just to sell more CDs, and it fucking worked, because if you gave me, like, a, a decent-looking cover, I might buy a Nirvana CD. Even if it has 80% songs I've heard before. That just reminds me of when the Daft Punk Random Access Memories was about to come out. Someone quote leaked the album online and had all the track names, but it was just, uh, I think it was just the single that had come. I forgot the name of it. God, get what lucky. was the single on? Get yeah, get lucky. It was just get lucky, done over and remapped to time, over and over again for all like twelve tracks. It's oh very God. funny. Hey, if it works, it, you know, I mean, you're a scumbag if you do it, but. But some people download and they're like, oh, I, I, I got it. <laughs> it got was just, album. it was bad because with these CDs, you know, that was a problem. Because then you'd, you'd spend yeah. like 30 bucks, 40 bucks on a bootleg rare. I remember one, they would call them virgin mixes. I've never heard that phrase ever. Outside of a couple Nirvana CDs I got in fucking shitty Wildwood or Seaside Heights. Virgin mixes version mixes okay like they're different i don't know very weird a pretty cool laser where'd you get that laser yeah. from i uh, unlocked it i like it oh that was a quality laser right there uh do y'all want to 100 percent this uh this mission or do y'all just want to just go for the I think we should 100 because it's such a short mission, right? I mean, I'm or is it? I don't know. Um, I'd say let's do the uh, this objective over here. I'm following Real you because I'm then... still not sure what I'm doing. 
And we can go and do some of the side stuff. You, you guys are real hell divers. I'm just a tourist. All right, we have the launch codes. Um, we can kind of make a circle around the map going down. Yeah. Okay. So this way. If I ever become destitute, I'm just gonna record my own songs off of a shitty boombox and cover so rubber band man. <laughs> Where? <laughs> right there. Okay. You'll have like a low ambient version of rubber band man. Could like do a, that. A noise track. Yeah. Just put a ton of reverb on it, slow it down. Call me in, though. Yep. Alright. I hate that they guide you now when you come down. They guide you? Yeah, so you used to be able to... You can still move around how you want, but, like, there's a certain zone you can do it in. Oh. So, like, I wanted to go I, uh, closer to my shit, I and I could... Yep, I got you, I got, I got you, Megan. I should have. I see what you mean, John. Nice. No, right. oh, that was that was so epic. Oh, jeez. I wish I saw it. I landed on top of the building and destroyed uh, it. Ah, top MLG pro move. Major League Gaming. Yeah, that's. I mean, I know that esports are like an old thing now. Like it's just accepted. But when I first found out about Major League Gaming, I even as a gamer my whole life laughed a little bit. I was like, this is never going to work. And then, yeah, it worked. <laughs> it became huge. And like I said, people, they ask what I do. And they're like, people watch you play games. I'm like, well, you watch people play sports. It's a good yeah. answer. Yeah, but one's cooler than the other. Yeah, games. One, one uh -huh. has like whole city locales dependent on them. The whole, the whole sports thing. That's true. You know what yeah. I mean? Like, anybody's got New York Spring? New Mac. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you don't need to know I'm a New York streamer. Based off of Vinny's stream is whatever you're saying. That's right. Well, I'm trying to revitalize the Alamo Draft House on Staten Island. So I mean, there you go. That's something. Uh, why don't you guys pull him in since he's close? I got him. Yep. He's actually close to you guys. I still think that's a really cool uh, design choice to like do like a combination to summon items. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh, okay. Wait, a combination of, of what? The, the key combo like a, gotta type in. Uh, yeah. In order to summon the, the stratagems, mm -hmm. you hold control and then you do combination. Oh, I, I of, didn't uh, understand what you said for a second. I'm, I didn't hear it properly. But yeah, that's that, fine. It, it's unique. And, it, and if you're like nervous in the game, like, and you're like fumbling it is very tense i enjoy that yeah i would definitely recommend rebinding it to um zero on your number pad and using your number your arrow keys and that way you can still run around while you do stuff i have them uh mapped to my my mmo gamer mouse thumb pad Quite smoky here. Have you guys played today this game? Nope, I have not. It was a St. Patty's Day. I went to Manhattan for a little while today. And um, it's not even St. Patrick's Day. Tomorrow is, you know, like the parade. Yeah. I've never seen so many green drunk people in my life. Man. It's a. Uh it's a weird trip if you don't know anything about it. Like, imagine just not, like, you just delete the information you have about St. Patty's Day, just wake up one morning and just I'd be horribly confused. It was confusing because I, I knew what was going on, but I forgot it was, like, the weekend of and it was, uh, right. yeah, walking around and just kind of, like, trying to get some, some empanadas and shit, and, like, everyone's drunk. I think I ran into some kind of influencer or something. There, there was someone who looked a little like a Sydney Sweeney. Like, she was just, like, perfect-faced. And people were stopping her and taking photos with her. And tell, I was like, 
ever I don't know who this is. You know, like you it's know, one of those situations. So I don't is know. Is this common is that common in New York where it's just like Calling at some point you're walking around and then there's like a bunch of press and people around somebody, you don't know who the fuck they are though? Is that like common? Because I, I saw it when I was there. Yeah, it might be common. It might be common-ish, but I got to be honest, it's not something I've seen a ton in my uh, in my time. I think it's just, um, I, I you know, everyone's famous is the problem. Like, yeah. like I said, I got stopped the other day in the city, you know, by, by um, Rockefeller. And, you know, here's someone like who watches my streams and videos once in a while. No one knows who the fuck I am otherwise. So I feel like this person might have been, it could have been like an actress or could have been like an influencer, like an in Instagram hmm. thing. But no idea who she was, um, had no way of looking it up, but like four or five people stopped her. So, and she was just drunk eating empanadas on St. Patrick's Day. Did we grab this code already? I got the launch code. Okay, yeah. this doesn't yeah. retrieve the launch code still for me, but yeah. Okay, well, let's go do this over here. I went to a, uh, I went to a car show today. Like, like a modern like a donkey car. show. No, no, right. <laughs> no, no. Uh, okay, sorry. <laughs> it's a, it's a good. Uh, I don't know. Probably be more interesting than what I saw. I'll tell you that much. Modern cars are fucking boring. Just like every car now has a giant fucking touchscreen in them that. Is gonna cause me to crash when I'm older because I don't, I've like, will learn, lose the ability to touch a touchscreen. Well, now but cars have for changing gears, there's just button. Like, you use press buttons in the middle. Oh, just, oh, yeah. Yeah. I missed the stick. It, this was in, I mean, this is in Iowa, so a lot of the cars are just massive trucks. Mm -hmm. And there was a truck that had a truck bed door. And I didn't see this before, but the truck bed door, as it opens, it turns into a little step for you. It adds a little steppy for you. A little hmm. steppy for you to get into your big truck. And, uh... So you can like, haul oh, them big fucking testicles around. Most trucks I see haul them nothing. Mm. Nothing. That's a shame. Just, really, it's a shame. Uh, Imagine how the truck must it, feel. It wants to be filled. Lifted as heck. Her. Rolling coal and diesel. Yeah. Make sure to change your oil in your vehicles. Yeah, that's true. Yes, sir. But the, also, the the cars these days are like, you must change your oil now. That happens a lot more these days. Yeah, every time you turn it on, alarm comes on. Yeah. It's very it's annoying. Like, what are you doing, base? Are you trying to change my oil? I would probably not use the car ever again if it did that to me. Well, that's the future that Munsk is pushing towards, I think. They don't, you know, well, I mean, you don't need to change the oil in an electric car. No, I know, yeah. I'm just busting chops. <laughs> okay, fair enough, fair enough. Where are we going? I don't know. side objective over here. I'm just following right. G2. My boy G2. Which is probably yeah, a car G2 brand. G2 and a G3, but no G1. Yeah, no, fucking G1. Remember that didn't, song, didn't show like up. a G6? Remember that one? Remember, remember that one? No. And, that, and I couldn't, uh, didn't know if it was the Pontiac G6 or the plane. Do you remember that song? I'm the hat man. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. <laughs> skip it, it up, my bit of drill. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's right. That's what he said. Here, when you guys can this one. Just imagining that really, like, reverbed out, like you are having a Benadryl Hatman experience while it's played, and that is... That's a meet with God moment, I think. Now, when you said meet with God, for a second my brain, like, <laughs> translated that, like, you're having, like, a meat dinner with God. But, like, a comical haunch of meat from, like, the walls of Castlevania. <laughs> or, like, the, the thing at the, at the end of the Flintstones intro, the big rack of ribs. That's the one. Yeah. That's good. That's a good that's a good piece of meat lore. I was uh watching um Hats Off Entertainment, I believe. And they're he, the Flintstones movie actually isn't that bad is the name of the video. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, okay. 
Oh, sorry about that. I didn't realize that the range of that was going to be so stupid. Wow, that's a big explosion right there. Yeah, it's just coming down and uh, everywhere. Yeah, stay out of the center for a minute. How about a, um, a bigger explosion? Damn, dude. You unlocked some big dick explosions. Oppenheimer would be proud. He would be. Or would he? And then w and he then would be because be if, if you didn't watch the movie right, you know, like if you're on your phone or like jacking your hog and falling asleep during the film and then getting ejaculated from the theater. Ejected, sorry, ejected. That's real, by the way. Um, if you were doing any of that while Oppenheimer was playing, then yeah, you might think Oppenheimer was the hero. And he loved it. Like, the dude was, like, so happy at the end of the movie. He's like, I did it. I am become death, destroyer of worlds. And, like, he looked at the camera and winked, and then it was, like, a staff roll, like, during the credits. <laughs> you know, like, a little smirk from every character. <laughs> I don't think that's how it went. Oh, whoops. Huh. I may have killed you. You may, you may. I was just about to do some good explosion uh, turrets. Uh, I have a bunch of stuff that I dropped, so you may want to pick some That's of them. I, I threw you. You can grab it. We'll be back. Yeah, I'll grab it. I'm gonna we'll grab that stuff. Join the fray. There we go. Um, I'll go ahead and take care of this over here. If y'all want to go for the, the rocket. I should be fine. How'd you like to chase all freedom? New Mac. Calling down a support weapon. I like when games like this are good. I it is good, like good when games, games are yeah. good. It's like a nice, I like a good co-op game that, that encourages teamwork and also... That's your gun, man. Oh. And the back, and the backpack is here, too. What's the backpack for again? This one is a shield. Oh, oh I got you, bud. <laughs> I saw that happen in HD, holy oh, crap. Mine. Oh my god, look how many mines are down there before you go past. You should uh, dive on them. Okay. Nothing bad will happen. Ouch. It's a shame about the early server shit with this game because it did keep me away from it for like three weeks. Or more. A little yeah. bit, you know, but... Ooh, base, dude. <laughs> I am getting barraged by rockets. Well, don't do that. I don't think I have a choice. Really enjoying the sniper rifle. Pack grenades, so I can't throw one in there. That's all good. I use all my grenades already, so I'll just grab it. My turret I'll is just this. shooting it. <laughs> my little robot is just shooting it. Oh, there we You're go. doing your part. I am truly a hell diver. We we We're dove. Going. We're diving. We, we dove headfirst into the maws of Satan's gaping asshole. And that's what it's all about, boys. That and teamwork. That's one way to say it. Mm -hmm. I'm sure there are several other ways I could have said that. I would like to think Satan's asshole is just like like the spiciest hot sauce imaginable. <laughs> There's probably you know what? Mm. Yeah, don't mm. it's ghost pepper. Don't I have sure a hot sauce called that. Satan's butthole? I I if there isn't one that's lost some market in there, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have something called that that Joel sent me. Oh no, Ass Reaper. He sent me Ass Reaper. Yeah. Same, same thing. Difference. Oh. 
They shot a flare. Throw in an orbital barrage, it's gonna suck. Oh, okay. Yeah, you might wanna... It's oh, such a waste, I don't even know why I did that. I don't think it's that much. Oh, I killed one of them at least. Yeah. That's nice. Oh. As long as we're, uh, as long as robots are dying, it's not a waste. Look at you. All right, we gotta get that um, that targeting data into the machine. Not a person. That was yeah. That was a robot. All right. Ready for the next step. Where are we going, Sarge? Hey, Sarge. Where are we going? You gotta use the machine. The yeah, program. we're uh, we're waiting for the rocket oh, okay. to oh, be yeah. wrecked out of the ground. So that we are waiting. Yeah. Oh, thank you for handing me ammunition. You're welcome. That is that was why I got the pack. The nicest thing that's happened to me all week, probably. <laughs> Boy, you got to see Madame <laughs> Webb. Sorry, Madame. Uh, that's pretty nice. Uh, it wasn't. It wasn't nice. I mean, glad I didn't have to. You know. Uh, I'm still chewing on the whole battle web thing. I think you gotta, yeah. You need, you need like it's like 2001: A Space Odyssey. You need, you need time yeah. to let it gestate within. Yeah. Oh man. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> I think I don't need this kind of psychic damage while I'm yeah, playing a video game. Yeah, you're right. Space, do it never. It's funny because I was walking by the village, the East Village Theater. Yeah. And. uh... The top billing was Oppenheimer. Yeah. They're, they're showing Oppenheimer. Oh, no, no, Dune. It was Dune Part 2. Oppenheimer okay. was also on there, but it was a little lower. And then the very bottom, it said, Tommy Wiseau in person. And I'm like, that's an amazing marquee. Dune, Oppenheimer, and Tommy Wiseau in person with the room. Up there with the greats, you know. Oppenheimer especially up there with the greats. It's unbelievable. Tommy, you know, the, anyone whose film is showing next to real life Tommy should consider that like a, mm. an honor. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> he fucking, he looked into the, the, the Ark of the Covenant a little uh -huh. too closely. I was not expecting it uh, to do that. Oh my god. There's two of us down now. Okay, that's a I problem. Got, I, it's no I longer cute. Uh, in, in, into in giblet. Right there. Be underneath that when it lands, please. Do you, did you get the other one, or should I do it? No, it's a both. Okay. Alright, it's both. Yeah. Right. Where did my stiff go? There it is. If you see samples on the floor, just pick them up. Okay, I forget to do that sometimes. Alright, we got Even if extraction, and we got three different bot zones in the same spot, so we might as well fall. We have time. What do you want to do, John? I mean, we gotta get to the extraction zone anyway, so let's see where we're at at time when we get over there. We can just run past these guys. We don't have to kill them. Oh, well, that's not a nice shot. Oh. Every every robot, right? You know. Well, the the mission doesn't oh. state to kill every single robot. I think that's the impl implied mission of Super Earth. No, no, that's, that's some her heretical statements you're making there, sir. Uh, yeah. Well, here's I'm a just, heretical I'm statement. I'm saying what the mission says. 
If Super Earth is so great, where's Omega Earth? We don't talk about Omega Earth. Um, um, oh, oh, Meg, oh, oh, my girth? Oh, my, oh, Mega Girth. Where is Mega Girth? If uh, Super, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 I feel like the graphic of that is bigger than its actual power, just for fun. Because aren't, I mean, all of the stratagems are viable, right? Like, that's the... Uh, yeah. There's some that are better than others. That's fair. Well, they apply to different situations. That's yeah, true. That's true. Like, honestly, the grenade launcher is probably not a great choice to bring here. Pretty much pure crowd control. I'd say the rail cannon probably isn't great on this level of difficulty. Mm -hmm. Anytime I hear drop shit now, I th I'm gonna think of like the term drop shipping. Oh yeah, yeah, I see that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm very good at deploying my stratagems like incorrectly, like or just at the wrong time after the battle is long over, you know. It's all right. I'll take it. You may fire when ready. Oh, ah. they exploded. Oh wait, you killed me. I might have got you with a shotgun. I don't know. Wait, no, you oh, yeah. some, of the, some of the fellas, some of the fellas explode when you kill them. That's that's yeah. what. That's why. Yeah. So I might have I might have exploded him, which then counted as my yeah, explosion. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I may have exploded again. That was quick. Whoever that person was I was playing as, they did not live a very long life. Yeah, that's that was the, that that soldier got like two seconds of this planet's smell. Yeah, sorry, it's good. That's a terrifying thought for space travel, though. What if there's some planets completely viable that just smell terrible? I would, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's why the helmets are aware that the nose thing can do. Yeah. I thought that was for recirculating their their piss into their. Yeah, but you put air freshener body. in there. It's the well, same thing. Yeah, air freshener. You can put a little Febreze, um, but it does recycle their poopy into water. So it becomes like poopy sludge, and then you just you just huff poopy sludge that's filtered through the still suit, like squeezed into water. It's a really cool universe. Frank Herbert was uh, was on something ahead of his time. Certainly. Oh, I got a couple buddies on me here. God, that rocket went right past my head. Oh my god. I keep it getting exploded. Every time. I keep dying. Keep dying, 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 dying. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! All right, oh, we got extraction, and I think Very one more hive uh, over here. To do that voice. What was the voice thing you said? 
Oh, uh, uh, Fred Durst is very squeaky. Yeah, he is. But he does, he like postures. He goes, yeah, I'm a bull. And then he goes, yeah. Yeah. But I was going to say, they should, it's a missed oh. opportunity okay. if they don't have it's a limp. Oh. What happened? No, I didn't know we were getting out of here. There's more stuff to do. Oh, I'm sorry. I fucked up. It's all good. We can't 100% it now. Mm. Unfortunately. But it's fine. We got most of I, it. Okay. I'm not going to cry. I'm sorry about that, guys. I'm crying. I, I thought we were getting out of here. I was going to make a really... You know what it is? Because I was... I was going to make a good joke. I need you guys to rate this joke out of 10. All right? All right. It's a missed opportunity that Limp Biscuit never had an album called Best of the Durst. You got a, a 50, 500k? I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna acknowledge that, Vinny. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I don't think it'd be a nice name for an album because, you know, it's a, it's a team effort, the Biscuit. Yeah, but you know it's all about the Durst. Team effort. In the band like Puddle of Mud and Limp Biscuit. And wow. Right, cool. I think cool, the. We did it. Oh, it, wait, nobody stayed. Okay, so now we <laughs> now we doubled it. Okay. We doubled it? No, I just mean yeah. nobody oh. stayed to wait for the strip to come come down, so now we gotta do it again. Just fine. I was oh, gonna go off and do it with, with base while we were waiting. There are a lot of robots now, though. A lot of robots. Watching Sentry! We got a tank. Thank you. Oh, I'm dead. Wowie! I got Some your samples. Some of the robots have uh, explosives on them. Then they go near you and explode. But, like, it's the best of Fred Durst and not... You know what I mean? So it's, like, the best of the Durst. It could just be the super cut of all the squeaky sounds <laughs> he you, makes, too, Can right? you repeat that again, actually? I don't think I got it the I'm first sorry, time. I'll stop. Or the second time. <laughs> Best of the dirt. Uh, I may oh, have killed I uh, got you this time. I died by burning. Oh, I didn't kill you. Okay. That is a warrior's death. You should feel proud to be in... What's the name of the Klingon? Valhalla. No, that's uh, Stovacor. I don't know. I don't know what happens. It's, it's Stovacor is the Klingon Valhalla. Valhalla. Yeah. Okay. What you know what happens in Klingon Stovacor, uh, uh, Valhalla? They just keep fighting. That sounds like Valhalla. Yeah, they just keep fighting. What? What would um? What, what would a Klingon Nirvana be? You know, they just keep like, fighting. Oh, and I was gonna say, like, what would a Klingon Nirvana song sound like? Uh, sir, bum as you are. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm just thinking of Klingon shaped box, and I don't know why that's so stupid. Uh, you don't want to trust me. I know about Klingon anatomy. You don't. Oh. You don't. <laughs> Killed by vine sauce. That's no, crazy. no, That's the game strange. is glitched. Why would it say that? So the uh, my 56k was jiggled. <laughs> Sorry about that, 56k. Okay, we don't lose anything from dying unless we run out of lives. Wow, that's a lot of fellows over there. Uh oh, a lot of friendos. Fine. I hope. Uh oh, I gotta get my oh, ammo. Oh, I really more presents. That's a nice present. Wow, it gets bright when you do that. I didn't kill a single one of them oh. with that explosion, by the way. See, it's all bark and no bite.
Going in. Standby for takeoff. Extraction complete. Pelican one beginning ascent. We did it. Okay. That was pretty good. I enjoy space. A space Fulton that just shits you oh. out the space reverse style. Oh, okay. Let's get back in the pod and launch the. Yeah, yeah, just get in the back of the pod and it shoots you back up. Yeah. Why couldn't you extract via Fulton? In, uh. <laughs> In Metal Gear Solid. That doesn't make any sense. I know. Well, you actually can. Oh, really? Yeah, if you stand on top of a shipping container and then Fulton the shipping container, you can grab onto it and then it'll lift you up. It'll take you home? Yep. Wow. Great job, Hideo. It was all him. He made the entire game from scratch. Yeah, he, yeah he made one that. guy He's, made he, all of the Metal Gear. When he was... Yeah, when he was... To get you know getting started on the design dock for that the first thing was balloon out of the level but only via box yeah exactly like he drew a, a dude with a balloon on him and and like he did that in his notebook in sixth grade <laughs> so, someone was like is it that that one nintendo game where the dudes with the balloons on them <laughs> but I don't fucking know the name of balloon fight is it balloon fight? Okay. It is. Yeah. It is. Good work collecting so many samples. Always good to have another hero on. Let's board. see them stats. Let me see how I did. Shots fired. Zot, you fired 141 shots. I fired 1,034. How? Like, what the fuck? Crazy. Uh, does, do you have a lot of turrets? Oh, that's all turret like, related? Faster, faster mm -hmm. firing guns. I have, a, like, a shotgun that fucking sucked. It sucked. I hated that gun. Yeah. I'm using a different gun. Which, which shotgun are you using? I'm I'm using one of the Primo ones that came with the most recent battle pass. It's called the oh. Punisher Plasma. And it's, uh, it's explosive. It got me killed multiple times. Not How do you get again. that page? Oh, the Dragon Breath one? No, it's different. It's Plasma. Oh, plasma. Oh, okay. Yeah, how do you get that page? What, uh, the, what do you mean? The cutting upgrades? edge. If you... You, gotta, you gotta pay with your super credits. Mm. Thousand super credits. Oh, but did the... you do that? Yeah. I don't know how to do that. Yeah, if you go to page three, it's ten bucks. Oh, no, thank you. You get, I mean, you get you get them through gameplay. I know, yeah, but it, you takes, can, you can you know, it takes a while. I'll never play enough of this game to get my plasma. It's okay, it's not good. That's what I'm saying. Oh it's, shit! Uh, All right. I've been saying that. I've been matter. saying that. Like, I'm disparaging myself in the fact that I I put a little extra money in this game to get the plasma, and it sucks. That don't do it. Or do it. I don't know. It's up to you. What's a booster? Hellpod space optimization. What is that? Oh, you can uh, whenever you start the mission, uh, or well. Wherever, whenever you before you start the mission, God, I can't speak for some reason. Um, you can choose it as your loadout, and it'll actually give you like a perk, uh, like a status effect. Because uh, I have one that I always choose that lets you spawn every single time with full ammo. I usually choose the one that gives everyone extra stamina because movement is life in this game. Yeah, it seems like. And it. I think they apply to everybody. I'm pretty sure. They they do, yeah. So if everyone has a boost, uh, they get to stack it. I don't know if the same boost stacks more than once, but... No. If, yeah, yeah. But all our individuals affect everyone else. I'm just buying a couple things and we can get started. Y'all ever been speech jammed before? I have. Yeah. I've tried it, yeah. Just now. Oh, it's like... It's <laughs> the worst, isn't it? <laughs> it's, uh... It's something. Yeah, I've, I've done the speech jammer. I've tried it. It was uh, definitely, yeah, it's tough to, to do that. True story. When I do a certain late night show host mm. kind of fellow, I have to, to get the, um, the, the dialogue in the room. I have to speak and hear myself speak. It's played back to me. 
So I know it's a little confusing, maybe, but yeah, it's uh. So it, yeah, I just have to hear the dialogue, and it it fucks with me. I I don't sometimes I don't know how Probably to like. It makes the dialogue more stilted anyway. It does, which which is actually probably for the best. Yeah. It adds it's like you're to talking it. like G-Man 100 percent of the time. See, there's a there's a bright side to everything. I'm almost done buying my crap because I had a lot more credits than I thought I did. And, uh. Trying to emote on you. There you go. <laughs> hey, buddy. Yeah, whenever you're ready, Vinny. I want to try this energy based weapon. These? Seem to be energy resources. But I've never seen anything. I'm, now I'm doing my bits, and I don't even have an audience. It's just you guys. What am I doing? Oh, good. Streamer brain has struck I learned, again. I learned, I learned a term from Ireland called "in the bits" recently, and I guess it means you're sick. I'm in the bits. Oh. Oh Lord, I'm in the bits. <laughs> Purchases permanent access to ammo provided by Support Our Heroes Fund. I like just gives more magazines. Um, you know what? I'll oh, I can get targeting software upgrade. Hmm. There's a helmet in the game that looks like the um, Leia. Disguise at Hut's thing where she goes Yato. It's in there. Yato. In this Bosh. Or Boosh. Well, I'm Mr. Turrets, so I'm just going to get one of those things. I got a ship module finally. So that's neat. Congrats. You're a real boy now. Like a, a Pinocchio, but with a long cock instead of a long nose. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Johnny, yeah. cut that. Johnny, cut that. <laughs> Johnny will not you know cut that. He's not going to cut it. No, and he was not even going to watch this. <laughs> what am I saying? That is funny. That is funny. Only to me, though. Okay, I bought some stuff, and I feel good about my decisions, except for that bit. I just <laughs> that I don't feel good about. <laughs> but hang on, I'm, I'm just changing some stuff. It's like an energy-based weapon. Pistol. Explosive grenade. And then, uh, should I change out of this jabroni outfit? I think that more third-person shooters should have capes. Liberty guide. I fight for it really I adds fight to for it. Super Earth. Liberty guide. I will protect democracy at all costs. Yeah, no, I, I agree with that. A cape, cape, cape. Wow, cape physics to get them to look really good. I feel is probably something that takes a little effort, but uh, I like it. I remember fabric physics in one of the red faction games just being fucking phenomenal and i was like wow fabric is real in video games that was something that was going around on the internet like just uh recently people were like talking about that, really? the red physics red faction physics yeah the and uh, how good they are you know let us decide where to yeah. enter the fray crimsica This world is riddled with terminate abominations. Where will you strike first? Hmm. The operation proceeds smoothly. 
track down and eliminate the bile, the titan? bile titan? We can do that. Yeah. Do we want to do that on a different difficulty? Um, we should be fine. Challenging? Or you yeah. want to go... Yeah? Do you think one difficulty up would be a little too much? Um, we, we might be able to do it. I want to try it because I feel like I would enjoy a higher difficulty. Do it. How do you do that, though? You, uh, you back out. I see. And then you, uh, there you yep, there you go. Oh, they're locked via... Oh, I see. So that was a specifically challenging mission. Hard is a different thing entirely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if, if you if you leave the terminal and go back, it probably will change them all. I think it changes them all, and you can look again, but I'm not 100 percent sure. Or you can check another planet too. Try a different planet. I mean, the the, the bile titans are pretty hefty guys, so. Oh yeah. Build terminids, prepare and launch ICBM. Uh, yeah, usually I'm not the one making these decisions, so. Evacuate civilians. This operation is complete. You have served democracy well. I kind of wanted yeah. to see the Titan, yeah. All right, so then oh, drop back down then. The Galactic War, a battleground awaiting your. Let's try one more planet. Invention. Hmm. No. Oh, you can tell. Yeah, if you mouse over it in that window on the right, it shows the three symbols, so not there yeah. either. No. No, yeah, you might want to drop back to the planet then. Oh, these are all done, these planets? Yeah, so, uh, um, it's not new. Nope. And then challenging. No. Nope. Yeah, you might have to drop down the challenging. Oh, yep, there, there you go. go. Oh, there's there challenging. Yeah. Another step yeah, whatever. Yeah. I'm fine with it. I just want to see what it looks like. But I figure we were playing fairly well. So I thought maybe hard would be good. But then, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll do this and we'll see. Sorry we keep playing this so late. Lately, this has been uh, the time I've been able to play. Oh, good. I mean, it's Saturday. I don't, I don't really care. What about here? Here? What about here? So if you click on that hexagon, you can choose your um, new, uh, what do you call it, booster. Okay. Allows hell divers to, to resist injury. Does this work for everybody? Yeah. Yes. Cool. I'm not bringing uh, ammo this time. That's fine. We could always call more. We already got a laser. Hold on. I'll go ahead and bring ammo. Oh, yeah, sorry about right. that. I'm just trying the laser. I'd never used it. Oh, that's fun. It's fun. Just um, don't overheat it. Otherwise, you'll need to reload. It has technically infinite ammo unless you overheat. That's weird. It showed it us launching out of my ship. Same tube. <laughs> oh, well, we're uh, right here. I'm going fully laser, I guess. Where did my tech pack go? Wait, where where my where did my shield backpack go? Right here, no? Uh, I see it. No, no this is the ammo. Oh. 
think it's the ammo. It was in strats. Oh, no, it is. Oh, never mind. It was not anywhere near where I threw the thing. We got hunter, stalker, fellas. Yep. I don't like them. There's a uh, ammo backpack over here that I cannot get. If anyone does not have a backpack. I don't have a backpack. Where's that shit? Um, so who has the auto us. cannon? Or whatever it is. Yeah, take, uh, I have a oh, guard yeah. dog. Oh, no, so rifle. Watch it. Someone called down that cannon, you want the back guy for it. Here, Vinny, uh, take this. You could be super laser man. More lasers? Yeah. More, More lasers. lasers. There, there you go. go. Yes, auto laser, babe. There you go. You're ready. Oh, man. All right, we got to, uh, let's do the side protector first. Oh, you're just shredding them. Fun. Yeah, those stalkers are out over here. I'm, I'm taking care of this cannon over here, so. All right. Yeah, those stalkers have a hive we need to take care of. I don't if, like those guys hunting. If you use your laser all, like, if you burn it out, do you... You, you have, have one... One thermal reload on it, and then I see. you overheat again. Then you have to call it down. Understood. Yeah. Yeah. So you got you got those hunters coming in. Oh, behind us! Oh, charger! Oh, Killed by Ace Clef. I wasn't able to turn around. Hmm. I think that's you. Wait, is there a bug oh, called Base Clef? I think one of my grenades may have bounced off the, uh, the bug. Oh, I thought there was a bug. So it was, that was technically the bug. bug's fault. I'm fine with that. I, I accept this answer. Someone wants to just Orbital. throw Hellfire over there. That would be great. What a useless fucking stratagem that is. Jesus. So inaccurate. Alright, cannons online. I believe we get access to that while we're playing. Has anyone seen my, uh, my cannon? I don't know where I died. Oh, it's way back down yonder. Well, it's gone then. There. Whoa, I'm sorry. <laughs> Get away from the charger. Oh my god. Get away from the charger. Thank you. Ah. Sorry. <laughs> oh. Okay, so that, that CF artillery, SCAF, is what I just prepped here, so we got five shots on it before it's dead, so we should use them sparingly. Okay. Cool. Alright, let's head over uh, to uh, this hive. Grab, um, oh, you... Awesome. That laser, that laser backpack is now uh, gone. I think it was on my corpse. It's okay. I'll respot it when. Get right. Oh, yeah. All right, let's move it. Shotgun on me, if you want it. Oh. Um, something over here. Do you think, like, a scrotal Pinocchio would just lie all the time? No. Why would you want your balls to be bigger? 
Not, no, <laughs> see, he said scrotal. It's not even just the balls. It's really just the, it's the whole the, thing. The, the skin. It's just a sack. Oh really. shit! Yeah. But I was gonna say though, it's like um, you could be like Randy Ball's big balls. Yeah, that didn't seem very comfortable. To squashing your own fucking nards. Nards. Wolfman's got him. Like, I died. I accidentally pressed my Windows key instead of Alt. I'm gonna rebind that. Real quick. We got a hunter. We got two hunters on us right now. Good. They did. Let's go find them. Gotta nest. find those nests. It's gotta be over here. There's another one coming. Let's take care of this and then we'll head south to try and take care of that. Sure. Looks like there's one left here. Uh, a minute at two on uh, the laser. Oh, that was silly. I've never seen these bugs before, man. They suck. Alright, yeah. let's head um let's head south and try and take out their nest before we do the bile titan. There's no no point mm. in trying to do that with these hunters on us. Yeah, sure. Got a minute on my laser cannon. Is that right to your right left here? Oh yeah. I just saw this one come out of it, though. So. Come on. Docker layer. Nice. Okay. Now we can take a look at that. Got an achievement for that. Uh, Vinny, looks like your laser cannon is directly south of us right now. Um. Yeah, let's, let's head that. Let's head. Let's head that direction while we head right. to the bases marker. All right, because I have you know a new one on the way. Are you able to new like one. so Zai that laser backpack? Say mm. I get the old one and you make a new one. Does the old one still stay on the map? Yeah. yeah. So you yeah. can just have multiple. Okay. Yeah, I got the recoilers for right now, so I have the I have the backpack for it. Even though I think cool, if I want a team reload, someone else has to wear the backpack, which is kind of. I don't know. I don't. Know if, I don't quite agree with that. You just take the the thing off my back, it ah, load make it. it significantly faster to team reload though. Like, yeah, it's true. Like, I just, like three times as fast. I'm just saying, like your team members shouldn't have to be the one wearing the backpack. They could just take it I off agree. your back. I functionally, agree. Just take it off my back. Alright, another uh, hand hand. Fuck them. <laughs> Fuck them. <'em. laughs> Oh, that was, that was, that was great. Ooh, you where guys were, for you? you guys were not where I was. No. <laughs> that was no, a mistake. No, we had said, hang on, don't go in there. <laughs> well, there go my equipment again. Well, you'll be, you'll spawn right here. Oh, it's fine. I killed myself. Does it show on the map where that stuff is? Yes. Yes. There's a guard dog right there. Oh, again. there it is. If you drop samples, it'll actually show that on the map, too. I don't see my yeah, laser cannon. There's an ammo getting... backpack there. We'll leave this nest here. Oh, I can't blow it up because I got stun grenades. So no, throw I, thought I, I thought I fucking got it. All right, hang on. I got it. Just stand back. All right, we got more nests to the south by extraction. I think we should do the bile titan and then head to extraction and do the rest. Sure. This isn't my guard dog. No, that is a gun guard dog. Whose is this? Oh, those are. It's a different guard dog. Yeah, it's still a guard dog. It's just a different guard dog. Nice base. Wanted to see what it did. It slows you. It, you you it doing that reminds me of the movie Prometheus. Like like these trained xenobiologists and scientists. So uh, like, I'm gonna throw something big in there. Hang on. Doing stupid shit on an alien oh, planet. Going, going, go in there. Going to a planet to take it off their mask. Mm hmm <laughs> I 
I got a really good view of that. Good. It's not worth fighting the big, the big dude. Uh, I'd like grenades if we have any in there. I don't think it doesn't look like we do. But do not shoot that. I just that like grenades. Yes. Thank you. Rare sample acquired. Samples and ammo. Oh, super oh, credits. Super credits. Oh, nice. Super credits. Some ammo. No one need, else needs ammo. Requesting mm -mm. orbital strike. Requesting orbital strike. Why, why is this like glowing here? It's weird. That's the, one of the, the effects of the things on the ground. It slows you down. Oh, weird. Let's use the uh, artillery. Watch out, base. Oh, oh. Dead. watch out, base. Calling down a sentry. Oh. Oh. No. I see. I want to kill the, the charger with the sweat of my brow. <laughs> Till the soil. Fire in the hole. Yeah, lasers are quite good. Enjoying this orbital cannon. I don't know if I like the the regular scythe weapon, which is like a primary. Those are the thing here, but it's all right. Here, I got laser dog back for you if you want it. Uh, I'll stick with gun dog. Very well. Gun dog's better personally. Reloading. Got a sample. Why? <laughs> we got samples My gun and dog's better than your gun metals. dog. Nice. Yeah. I wonder if they're ever gonna do like um like a fucking eight or sixteen player mode in this. Yeah. Just I hope like, so. like a big fucking massive one. You know, I would love to see I, f I feel like that's the next evolution of this game, is like thirty two people on a map just going mental. Yeah. Yeah. Controlling points and Yeah. Like having more of like a str like grand strategy to it. That'd be great. I do wonder if this you know, if the engine can handle that many people and that many bugs but destiny destiny one engine right here is it yeah i think so that's where i've heard at least super credits grenades here if anyone needs i'm good thank you stems and ammo by me I'll take a stim. You got any fidget spinners? Uh, I got a whole warehouse full. I'm gonna stop buying them. Truly, they were the NFTs of their time. Two for one right now. All right, all right, cool. I, remember, I almost did spinners. vine sauce fidget spinners one year. You should have. They would have been a little expensive, like, because I I make shit for conventions, and I give them away for free. So for me, it's like the uh, cheapest possible item. And this year, the frog weebles were a very reasonable price. Weeples, rather. But uh, last year, the alien, I did inflatable aliens. Way too expensive. <laughs> sorry, dude. Uh oh, did I want to? All right. I, I, I didn't mean to punch you. I, I didn't. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. I didn't mean to punch you. Where is the big guy, though? That's what's, what's concerning. The, right the, the Capone, the uh, the mob boss bug, level fifty mob boss bug. Level so, fifty mob it's boss. Interesting that's taking us a long time to find something as big as the Bile Titan. It's, it's, 
Once you see it, uh, you'll, you'll know. This world does look wow. pretty pretty alien. One, two, three, four, five. There's like five or six outposts, bug outposts over here. So I think once we start eliminating them, bug forward operating ba bases. Boy, I just fucked that eagle north. And they throw up. Watch yourselves. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This will call the big guy out, huh? What a what a what a duck shoot we're doing. This is great. Nothing wrong will happen. Surely. Nothing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Base, I suck. Yeah. Oh god. The kill zone. I oh there he is. Get over here. Where is he? Uh, the, ch the charger knocked me into the kill zone. Get some! Get some! Oh, I guess you didn't reinforce me. Oh. Uh, oh! How did you die? Sauce. Oh, my laser. I chopped off my own leg with it. <laughs> Where'd the big guy go? Down in the kill zone. I got him. He's dead. No, that's that a mild time. That's a charger. Yeah. That was a charger. Oh, yeah, a charger. Yeah, charger. Uh, where'd where'd my laser go? I I'm looking on the map. It's right on me. It. It's right on me. All right. Are you G three or two? I'm two. I think that's my stuff actually. Oh, that's not my stuff. It. Yeah, I got it. I can raise right. my own. Never mind. And I'm dead again. Oh wait, not yet. I'm dead. That's what's her. Killed by Vine Sauce. Mm -hmm. Interestingly enough. <laughs> I, saw, I saw a glimmer of kill in your eyes. Even though you're wearing a helmet. Fuck did that bug just go to space? <laughs> they do that sometimes. But, uh, uh, yeah. Why is it Oh, there's my stuff. Yeah, yeah, How do you, you can hit tab and then use the mouse wheel to scroll in and out? Yeah, uh, help. Bring me back. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, you're coming in. Got you. Alright. Oh. Uh, Um, <laughs> let me drop a backpack here if someone needs it. Good Killed backpack. by impact. Who who among us is named Impact? Not me. Oh, okay. All right, I gotta find my Ready cannon again. Oh man. Oh, I found him. There's a laser cannon right here. Okay. There he is. Ah. I got a swine. All right. 500k out on the surface, watch yourself. Blow up! Oh, I didn't kill him. Okay. You gotta be like on him. Yeah, I used my other one already because I thought someone called it here. But... Also, I am dead. Stay still. Got him. Nice. Good shit. Oh, 
Oh, oh my god, it's hot. Oh. Okay, thanks a lot. Oh, okay. killed all, right. all of us. Hey, first off, not my fault. My mortar's fault. Mm. So that's just, still it's still your fault. Secondary, secondary fault. There's not a reason why we don't fault. run mortars. There's a degree of distance between you and I and the death I gave you. There's there's a reason we don't run mortars, laser backpacks, or turrets. And that's why. <laughs> just oh my god. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna shoot my mortar now. Okay, it's dead. I killed the, the number one enemy of our team. Help. Gotcha. Alright. I'm getting the samples. I, I, yeah, I dropped samples and shit. I dropped my laser cannon again, which sucks. Samples over here. Yep, your laser cannon's right over here. I'm on it. Point me to the enemy. Okay. There's another laser cannon even right here. Oh wait, no, there isn't. Now we just gotta go to trash. I guess we could do uh, these first. So we only have four reinforcements. Alright, where are we going then? I marked it on the map. Following you, base? Yes. Here. Ow. Sorry. I know it's not your fault. It's the fault of the mortar. <laughs> and the lasers. I need to add a healer class uh, to the game. Uh, or a medic gun. So you can shoot democracy, I mean bullets of healing. So let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. We can scat daddle. Oh. Before the hat man shows up and gets us. Base, you got ammo? I do have ammo, yes. I would love a little bit of ammo when I catch up here. Oh, that's a charger! Oh, oh for fuck's sake. Yeah, that's a charger. Alright. I got some turrets over here if you come to me. I got, I got them. I got some turrets. Oh, it, yeah, the stun grenades work really well. Oh, it oh, hit shit. the rock! Wow, look at that. Look how long that stuns him. I wasn't able to get behind him. What a waste of stratagems I just did. Jeez. Oh, there we go. He's dead. He's dead. As soon as you uh, shoot the, uh... You got some. Yes. Thank you. There you go. I got him, guys. <laughs> but I'm, I just fucking lasered his corpse, and I'm helping. I promise. Oh, you're doing something. We still have the, uh, the artillery. Everything yeah, I use a little bit of it, but we still have some. Oh, okay. Guys over here. How about a nice cup of liberty? Slow me down right next to the big dude. You guys right over there? Mm hmm. Yeah. We're observing the. Oh, the, shit. The flora and fauna of the planet. Yeah. I should probably want to make it over here.
Oh, more chargers. Oh my god. Right behind you, bitch. I'm dropping a 500k by me. Watch out. Down. Four chargers. To our left. Ben. Mm, I know. Let's just run. Run, run, run. Keep that ass moving. Ow! Keep it going, baby. Ah, oh, damn. He stopped running after me. Thank you. We pretty much yes, 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 yes. Yes! Oh, that <laughs> saved me. No, it didn't. Yeah. Oh, my God. How the hell? I'm still alive somehow. This charger's all up in here. Come here, buddy. Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Come on. 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 Hit him. Alright, destroyed his butt. Nice. Positive. Cool. He's done. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna see what this is. Big uh, bug breach detection. Oh. Turret, please. Turret. Not to be trusted. Got me good. Yeah, sorry, I thought you were gonna keep backing up. <laughs> it's all right. I put you right next to your stuff, so you should be able to get it pretty easily. What do you see over there, base? There's a uh, there's one little hole right here. Bug hole. All right, y'all can uh, start the extraction. It's good. Requesting orbital. Got an orbital on the way over there. Hopefully that helps. Hopefully they actually continue going that way. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Also destroyed my turret. Good job, orbital. It does that. Back up, mortars out. I'm in K by the charger. Wow. Beautiful. Let me go get him. 
I got it. Uh, I threw the thing. I threw the uh, artillery. Okay. Get oh. Hit. Well. It's worth the shot. It's dead. Yeah. yeah, we got this, right? Reload. Don't get on it. Don't get on it yet. Yeah. <laughs> no, I didn't realize that was happening. That's fun. Uh, um, try diving. Try and dive out the door. We got a, we got a charger coming, so yeah, the sooner you can figure that out. Hold on. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Like a banshee from Star Trek. Never seen that happen before. Yeah, with me, there's always, always a chance of something stupid happening like that. I feel like we accomplished something there. We did. We got every objective. Yeah. It was fun. I don't know if I would go with all laser build. I did like <laughs> double laser. I don't know. But I enjoyed the laser cannon. The orbital cannon was fun. Sometimes you need bullets because they're very satisfying. Oh, obviously lasers have done me well. Wow, yeah. you got the most kills. Yeah, yeah. Mission accomplished. They have, and yeah, quickly, too. Yeah, okay. I got the funny number for my accuracy. Hmm. Which funny number? The 69 um, number? Yeah. Uh, that, no, that's the 420% number. number. Liberation penetrator, huh? Yes. Yeah, I don't think I'll be getting that premium war bond anytime soon. Probably not. Not for a while. I can get a rocket sentry. That sounds great. That's only a good no, way to kill go your wrong. teammates. I enjoy that. <laughs> I would know because I'm usually the guy who's, who starts the mines. Well, I can... uh. I can equip the title of Master Sergeant now. Oh, well, that's the guy from Halo. Yeah. Crazy how they put them in the in this game. Chief Petty Officer John Halo takes his helmet off, fucking hangs dong. 
goes around from his helmet. Hangs dong from his helmet. Yeah. He's a cool guy. Is it like so long that it like comes out of his like helmet? And yeah, like takes it off. Did you ever see that dude with crazy. the longest nose in recorded history? They made like a little wax yeah. statue of him. It's like that. They made a wax statue of him. Yeah, there's like some some dude with like a legendary dong nose, and uh, they, for some reason there's just like a wax statue. Yeah. Um, speaking of dong, do you guys want to do another mission, <laughs> or do you want to uh, yeah. like a, we can do it real quick because it is getting a little late. I think we got sure. one more on the operation. We got to do anyway. It's part of the operation. Okay. Is like, what up, bro? It's the what up, bro pose. It is. Geological survey to identify valuable ore. So it's just these two things? For our main one, yeah. We could drop over by that side one and do a uh, clockwise sweep. Yep, sounds good. Yep. So drop here, gear? Yeah, uh, we just... Oh, you know what? We're going to have to run across this area here because we can't swim. So this is going to be a fun one. We're going to have to go down oh, no. and then back up. So why don't we start so here? we might as well start... Yeah. Go there oh, and go well there. Down here. Yeah, down here and do counterclockwise sweep. Man, the horns, horns in the build-up section is just great in this song. Ah, oh, man, great. It is really good. I love me some chunky, chunky orchestral <laughs> horns. This has been my drive to work soundtrack for the last week. Huh. Also, it is kind of insane how far sound libraries have come from like oh, yeah. music. Like, I, oh, I think sorry. nowadays you can't even tell the difference. Thank you, Duard. The Hell Diver drop pods are shaped like bullets because the people are bullets. We're bullets. Oh, that's deep. You know what else is deep? Into the, planet. the bugs are representation of bugs we're like Whoa. bullets they're like bugs whoa let them Same come too. let them brawl let them face the insurmountable fire. might of the hell divers requesting tack pack just wasted some ammo that's fun Yeah, just watch out for the water on this map. Gotcha. You will drown very quickly. Rear hmm. Oh. Ah, fuck. I, uh... Thought you I had it? my shotgun out. Had my grenade Oh my god, what is this thing? Bile spewer. Bile spewer. It's dead. They die pretty quickly, but they spew bile. That's the answer to Chiardi. Chiardi right here. I got him. I got him. Very nice. nice. That was perfect. That looked amazing. All right. Oh, here's a thing. Yeah, that's, that's the, what we're surveying. Back 
Sorry, sorry. Damn it. Uh, I want that energy shield you got. Um, I'll drop one next time I have one. Oh, I'm dead. Uh, yeah, they spawned six to the and left and of me. I didn't see them. How do you change the RP? Oh. Hold R. Got it. You can't do it on every level, but... Mm -hmm. How's it looking over there? Where? Where? Um, oh, the terminal. I pressed the button. I think we're about done. Yep. Mission is progressing. All right. Um, the grenade launcher is gone. It was on the. I saw it on the ground. Oh, wait, I got it. I got yeah. it. Okay. My eyes just aren't working. Legolas. That or my brain isn't working. Legolas, what do your elf eyes see? Dropping a pin. Just a no close up of like booty. Nothing. I see nothing. <laughs> this is extraction. We can leave this alone for now. Okay. I mean, you can go explore it, but. Yeah, there's no need. We'll be there later. Oh, that reload gives you grenades. That's cool. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ooh, artillery. Again? It also gives you stems. It gives you everything. So let's not use the terminal until we have five of the rounds close by. I've got the package. Yes. So just bring them, bring them right to the center, Vin. And drop it. I don't it. know if you've done this. Yep. I don't know if yeah. you've done this one before. No, I haven't. Okay. So basically what we're doing is we're loading this cannon, and that's what allows us to use that SEAF cannon like we had last game. Mm-hmm. Um, because we're loading it, and depending on what you load and what order is what you get. So if you put all napalm in there, you'll get all napalm. If you put all artillery, you'll get artillery and all that. So we can we can choose. So someone can start up the the, the computer now. Okay. I'll do the computer. Yep. And then whatever order we load these in is what we get. Um, I typically don't like the napalm, but... I don't even know which one's which. If you pick them up there, or if you look at it on the ground, you'll see what they are. I think the red tip is napalm. The red, like, dart tip. This is smoke. I don't want smoke. Get rid of smoke. Um, the, the red missile tip is explosive. Looks like, uh... We got... We got... Um... Something. Napalm. And then artillery, artillery, artillery. Requesting sentry. Calling down a sentry. And that's what I'd like. Nice. Cool. Alright, so we have the artillery to use now if we want. Cool. Um, we left a nest behind us. I don't know if we want to do that or not. Uh, uh, I, I, can, I can go and do it real quick. I'll catch up with you. Okay. okay. Alright. Cool. Yeah, a bit of propaganda. Where's that? Uh, it's marked as the little radio tower uh -huh. in the northeast. I see it. Yeah. Got grenades here. Bug outpost spotted. Some range on that shotgun, huh? Oh, the shotgun's nice. Are you using the same one as me? Yep. Just, yeah. Yeah, that's a nice one. It's got... Why does it have so much range? I, I like it. Oh, I mean, normal shotguns have pretty good range, yeah, too. They, <laughs> they do. I'm gl I'm really happy. Like, that's the thing. I don't see a lot in video games as, as much as I'd like to. Which is shotguns with actual range. Is that a breach by us? No. You gotta play uh, Cabela's Buck Hunt number... 22 for the real shotgun experience. I got the, uh, I got the orb going. <laughs> yeah, that was wow. amazing. Wow. Great. There's a uh, button over here by me. I'm on it. Before I get killed. Oh, 
What do we got? Samples and medals. Nice. Some stims down here as well. How are you doing over there, base? Got it. Good. Is there ammo down there? Yes. I'm gonna take the easy way out and just destroy the propaganda. Okay. Wait, there's options? You can blow it up or deactivate it with the terminal. There's a charger over there, so. God damn, that's so cool. Almost there. Oh, Did there's you see a charger that? over there. This charger likes me. Yeah, dodge perpendicular to him when he's charging at you. He's dead. Got him. The nest over by me. Reloading. I see it. Oh, that was pretty easy. All right, now we can go. I guess all the way over here. Very nice. And this is like that time I had my magnifying glass back, back when I was five, six. Burning up them ants. Burning ants. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if that's a universal experience across the world. Is like getting fascinated by ants. And then being cruel to them. There's probably people watching this that would say they've never hurt an I ant. I think monkeys do that, so that's okay. They eat them, don't they? They they know how to use sticks to get ants, and they eat them. So, no, I'm, I'm not eating ants. Kill insects or bugs just by walking outside. So, that's true. Yeah. I always, I think about that sometimes. I'm like, oh, what if there's like a little frog or something in the grass, in the tall grass? I don't know. Setting. All the bacteria you're killing by stepping on them. Yeah. You can play that game to infinity, I guess. You could. There's, yeah, there's an infinite amount of things that you are accidentally ending. <laughs> At every moment. Can't use hand sanitizer. You're killing all the germs. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I mean, bacteria isn't cute, so it's not that cute. Yeah, I'm sure people I've seen it up close in a mic. Things. Yeah, yeah. I've seen it in a microscope. I don't know. It's like, I mean, yeah. Little little, little water bear tardigrades are cute. Those are cute. Yes. I, let's be real. You drink those. Yeah, and there's shrimps in the water fountains in New York City. Like little sea monkey type shrimps. Good protein. Oh, uh, what is this? Uh, I can't tell weapons this is. It's just so bright here. Stalwart here, if anyone needs it. What do we got going on here? Alright, we're heading over. Tagging map, northwest, 300 meters. Well, that's a lot of water. That's a heck. Yeah, I wonder if these you maps can't are. Swim. You can't swim that. Generated. Yeah, this map sucks, honestly. I mean, it's an interesting design choice. Uh, it forces you to plan your route carefully and to, you know, be aware. I mean, we can get attacked out here if we're not careful. That's true. That would be interesting. I just think it's odd that we could fall from space, but we can't swim. 
Uh, you want to swim with this much gear on you? Go ahead. Now, oh, see, now we're getting attacked from <laughs> while we're on the island. <laughs> Is that you doing all right? Yeah, I'm doing fine. I'm, you might as well I'm just gonna, come over here. To, yeah, I'm going over to y'all. I just kind of happened upon some bug friends. Oh. I don't know if, like, y'all had ever, like, had ants in your house growing up. You're like, oh, man, I got ants in my house. Mm -hmm. uh, I yeah. did it in my last apartment. It was really bad. When I was growing up. We had, a, we had an ant. And then we had crickets. Oh, crickets in my house. The, the spider crickets now they live in the basement. Yeah. Oh, no, we have fuckers. I hate them. We have big, big old crickets that would hide in your room and then start cricket. Yep. You know, and then, and you're like, well, I'm not sleeping tonight. Yeah, I've been there. I'd rather listen to that the beep of a, a fire alarm all night. The chirp. The battery's out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, ants, uh, house centipedes. Remember those? Those are fun. Yeah, yeah, a lot, a lot of good things. But you know, rare sample collected. You ever had moths? Not an infestation. A little bit. Um. I grew up in a in a trailer home at one point, and uh, roaches were a really really big problem because there's like really big trees all around us that was like with leaves that were like uh, over the home, so they would like mm. drop in on the roof and then find a way inside. It was uh, very traumatic. <laughs> Something about roaches just just makes them like ten times worse than other insectoids i saw a squashed roach in manhattan today just like a, a big new york city like juicy roach just squashed <laughs> and packed it into <laughs> the sidewalk <laughs> and i was just like Oof. a rat is gonna find that or a pigeon i don't know if they eat bugs but i don't think pigeons eat bugs right oh yeah they're oh. they're they're descendants of dinosaurs they'll eat anything they'll eat other pigeons no, that's good. Good for them. Fire in the hole. Heck, when I, when I was raising chickens, chickens would eat snakes. Vicious. Vicious raptor-like beings with small brains, but, you know. Yeah. Calling down a sentry! Sending down sentry. I like pigeons. I like them a lot, actually. And people give pigeons a lot of shit, but they're they're all right. Oh, there's a CGI pigeon in Madam Web, Marvel movie made by Sony, <laughs> now available on digital on demand. <laughs> why couldn't they get like a real pigeon? Like, why are they taking I, jobs away from pigeons? I don't. I don't know. I don't know. But it it. Uh, I don't care about spoiling it. In, in the scene. Yeah, I don't, don't want to hear it. Oh, okay. I, I do want to hear it. I do. Oh, so she has... Okay. So she has premonitions, right? So she can see the future, like... But it's not really explained how she can. Or, like, with the mechanism. But who cares? But she, she sees a vision of a of a pigeon running into her window and cracking the window. And it gives an imagery of a web because it's Madam Web made by Marvel Sony ATM. Yep. Anyway, <laughs> she she needs to stop it. And so she it didn't happen yet because she saw the premonition of it, and so she opens the window, and then the pigeon flies in, and it lands on her counter, and it's CGI. And it's really bad CGI. It's bad CGI? Oh, nice. Yeah, overwork the CGI them employees. All the really bad. Yeah, overwork yeah, and underpay. Bad. Hell yeah. If that's even happening, who knows? But yeah, it's just, it's funny how these movies are just getting, like, shittier and shittier looking. <sighs> it, it looked worse than, like, a serial, like, crime show on, on CBS or something. Like, it's it looked worse than NCIS, or like, uh, I don't know, Damn. it's, yeah, it's bad. I'd find out the director, I guess, directed an un unaired, cancelled Game of Thrones TV movie. That's huh. all I know about, yeah. 
Yeah. Good choice and for your movie. And the movie had seven writers. It's probably like one of those low stakes, just don't even put that much budget into the fucking... They know it's like a turkey. Just... Oh. oh. Wow. <laughs> That's why I watched that melted me. That's yeah. a lot of lead to the dome oh, very quickly. <laughs> Holy shit. That guy I, probably didn't even know it happened. <laughs> no, 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 no. Well, you, you just, you woke up in, Val in Valhalla. <laughs> <laughs> it's like your, your gray matter was very quickly replaced with lead. <laughs> um... Yeah, they probably found... Don't get between the gun and the, <laughs> the guys again. Yeah, it's a good yeah, gun, but that. holy shit. Uh, they probably knew what, like... Like, it was just gonna be... Like, here's this Z-tier superhero movie. You, so... You get to see... Well, the you know you why, right? The, why? Um, Sony and uh, Marvel have a deal that Sony can keep making Spider-Man IP stuff. But they have to do a certain amount. And so, oh, Spider-Man is in the Avengers or whatever they're doing with Sony. They have no Spider-Man really to use. Mm -hmm. So they're doing not so Spider-Man, Spider-Man. There's, Spider there's, gotcha. there's Venom and shit. Spider-Man lore in the movie, though. Oh, I'm sure there's, they're trying to tie it in lore. to make it worth time. Oh, but, no, you get to. I mean, I don't want to spoil it for your for your viewers, Vin. So I won't. Yeah, don't. I'll strike. I'll just strike. I'll just strike. Uh, I'll just strike. Pigeons not I, spoiler, gonna, though, no, it? that's not a spoiler. That's just fun. But I will be um, watching that film at some point with um, friends and and a drink or two, perhaps. That's at least that's the plan. I don't know if that's going to happen. I I would, yes, I would recommend you do that. I I think you would, at the very least, the last act is com complete nuts. So there's that. Whose flamethrower is this? It might be an environmental one. Oh, organically grown flamethrower. Mm -hmm. Artisanally made as well. Artisanally crafted. All right. We gotta make our way around. You lighting yourself on fire there? I love it. Yeah, we gotta go a long way around here. It's a shame we can't use the mechs anymore. Uh, oh, you just get... It's a stratagem. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's a very yeah, expensive stratagem at level 35. 25 or 25, is it? Yeah. I'm not even close to that yet. Yeah, it's it's funny, though. The Marvel stuff, like, fatigue, I think, is, is real. Mm -hmm. And I feel like... I... Yeah. It's the fatigue, but then... Especially oh, it's the shit Sony movies ones. too. It, it's shit movies right. and fatigue. Well, Vin, Vin, this is this is ten times worse than Morbius. Madam Web is. I I've really? heard, and I've heard that Morbius it's, is actually less funny compared to this because this is like so bafflingly terrible. Is that it, true? It's, so I I've I've watched a lot of bad films, uh, mostly from like nineties and eighties, and they all kind of have they're bad because they're just like. I don't know, the schlock. This isn't... I wouldn't even call this schlock because... It's... You can see a level of... Like... Competency? Ah, it's, it's, it's not just incompetency, it's like... Ah, it's so hard to describe. You kind of have to see it for yourself, and I think a lot of people will say it. It just... Baffles you. As you watch it. And it... There... There are scenes that just kind of... I don't want to say they just happen, but it's kind, of, it kind of, it's kind of what it is. It's just... We're cutting to this scene now. Uh, we're going to pan the camera around now. There's some times where they zoom in the camera for no reason. Oh, they do it constantly. Wow. That's for me? Oh, thank yeah. you. Uh, how did... I didn't see did you in the strategy. Did you do a uh, shoot a hell bomb? I must have! But I didn't see it. Wait, did we I watched you blow it up, Bob. You can find Is it those on the ground. Like, scattered. Yeah, you can find them just on the ground. Throwing grenade. How do you like to chase the freedom?
Well, on the topic of good films, we recently watched, um, uh, Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Ah. I hadn't seen it at all the way, all the way through recently. That's, a. Uh, I'm surprised at how, like, vulgar that film is for a kid's movie. I guess it's a kid's movie. Uh, it, it is, but that's the thing that's great about it, isn't it? Because if you're a kid, you can watch the Roger Rabbit being silly cartoon stuff. Yeah. And then when you're an adult, like, I know that's like the thing is like, oh, jokes for the adults, but that's actually more along the lines of, um, like, more adult stuff. But, like, again. Yeah. If you're a kid, like, I watched the movie as a kid, my parents didn't, like, stop me. They didn't say, oh, well, this is too vulgar. You know, we just watched yeah. the movie. And, yeah, it's great. So, like, really, really fantastic movie, even to this day. Mm. And then he went and did Mario. Yeah, Bob Hoskins, huh? Yeah. Hope he got a good paycheck. He's the same voice, basically, for, for Mario as he did. For for Roger Rabbit, it's like the and same voice. And he's an Englishman too. That's the he yeah. was. Yeah. Calling in extraction. Uh, but I believe Roger Rabbit is how he got the role anyway. So. Oh, okay. That makes sense, though, right? I mean, you have a guy who looks like Mario a little bit, and he's like, "Oh, right, that's him, right? We can just get Mario." Wonder how he felt being typecast as that voice kind of guy, you know? Well, so, yeah, like... There's He's the had a rough... legit career, too. He's done, like, theater rough. and shit. Okay, the Lou... Uh, like, the Super Show was, like, the first live Mario, right? I believe so. Yes. And that started kind of the, the gruffer-voiced Mario. Yeah, I And think then so. that... Okay. Because there was, like, I think there were cartoons in Japan, and it was, like... However, the Japanese voice actors interpreted Mario. But, like, you know, you think of, um... Italian guy... from New York that looks like that, and you're gonna think, Oh, hey, how you doing, you know? Wow, oh. gear. Wow, Holy that did not land scorched, anywhere when you were right through scorched it. Scorched Earth. Shit. Scorched Earth, motherfucker. I Holy do believe, shit. I do believe I dropped some samples. Okay. Um, somewhere where my corpse may be. Costco samples down in the, in the pit. Oh man, you, you just saying that makes me want to go to Costco. Some, some frozen Spanakopita. I don't know what Spanakopita is. It's like a, I think it's like a Greek flaky sort of thing. I think that I want to. I want to make sure I'm right. I, I I could be missing that up with cornucopia. One second. Okay. I know I'm right. It's like a. It's like a Greek spinach pie thing. Yeah. I'm right. All right. I'm. I'm. I'm, I'm in check with my references. For there you go. You know what's up. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Or like the little little like a uh, corn dog. Like little corn dog mini things. Mm -hmm. Ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready. Countdown initiated. Stand by I've been wanting to do that at, like every extraction, but I just never got the chance to. Do what? Just shove someone. Oh. Oh, that was you? <laughs> that was me. Nice. Oh, oh we missed this... one. Damn. It's fine. I have to uninstall the game. We missed one. Game uninstalled. Gamer card revoked. Wow, you missed a whole star for missing one? <laughs> mm. Jeez. And we did everything else. That's crazy. Nice. I feel like we're really making a difference in this war. We are. I feel like the, the Terminex of the galaxy. 
We did point zero 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 two five each. No, five each. That's awesome. Look at us. The war. Look at that. Just being a bunch of dudes, killing bugs, making a difference in the war, getting them uh, cosmetics and shit. That should help keep the bug population. I got the funny in check. number again. Face. Stop I'm starting it. to like wonder how this is happening. How are you doing that? Uh, it's like counting his bullets and like doing math in his head. It's like, oh, okay, well, I can't <laughs> shoot now. I gotta save it for later. I accidentally got 0.4% off, but you know. You're like, yeah, I, I could just see you like, all right, like you're like card counting for poker, but you're bullet counting for the funny 69. <laughs> That's your I'm one sure people superpower. That. That's like, yeah, like. There's someone out there that does something like that, and they have no other notable skills, except they know exactly how many bullets they've shot in a video game. Isn't that weird? Like, humans being weird like that? We got shit like that, don't we? Like, we have people we that do. can, like, go up in a helicopter and, like, see a city and then draw the whole city when they land. Like people, or that, like, count all, like, the, all the specs on, like, their popcorn ceiling. Like, people like that. On the popcorn ceiling? You know, you know like... Yeah. yeah. What does that mean? Asbestos? Like the asbestos popcorn ceiling? Like this, the ceiling yeah. that you see in some like, houses that's like sparkly, but also really like... It's got like... If you scraped your hand against it, you lose all your skin on it. I know what you mean. And there are people that yeah, count that? I'm sure, I'm sure there's got to be somebody out there that's just like staring at the ceiling all day and just decided to count all of it. I'm sure too. You know what's funny? You can kind of invent someone, and they probably have existed. And it maybe even you'd walk among you at this moment. It's Mongus. wild. Mongo. 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 Hang on, let me play the song. Okay, I played the song. It was funny. All right. Well, thanks everybody for helping uh, me play Super Earth game. I enjoyed. I hope uh, everybody out there enjoyed watching. And, um, once again, I am here with Base Clef, Gearomatic, and Great Zot. And you know what we did? We defeated the Hat Man. So, pleasant dreams, yeah, everybody. Make a difference. Make yeah. a difference in your own galaxy. And uh, your with, hat man. with your own Hat Man. Make a difference with your own Hat Man it's, and, and your own friends. Because that's what it's about. Summon him tonight. Summon him now. Find a way to get the hat man into your life, become friends with him, and that way you could say the Benadryl was actually more about the friends you made along the way. Good night.